Welcome Cryptopians to Total Crypto Updates, bringing you another video for real deep dives into the crypto industry. I can't promise to only speak about crypto, but I can promise everything will be overstood. Let's dive into today's very dense crypto update. Coinbase is a major cryptocurrency exchange, primarily in the United States. Blockchain projects are eager to get their coins listed on this exchange. Our review team investigated numerous new Coinbase listings, detailing their use cases, advantages, and how their features help investors. We cover crucial information on why and how to acquire cryptocurrencies before they launch on Coinbase, since an imminent Coinbase listing is frequently a positive driver for a token's price. Hedera, HBR, Hedera, popular, HBR blockchain popular blockchain and alternative and public ledger platform. Hedera is a new Coinbase, Hedera listing, is a new Coinbase, that Coinbase listing that aims to give a better alternative to blockchain. It is advertised as, it is a, advertised safer as a safer and more efficient blockchain alternative that is also 10x quicker than other blockchain alternatives. Apart from being one of the, new, from being one of the new cryptos on Coinbase, Hedera takes pride in being carbon neutral and having Hedera allows enterprises to construct a private ledger while utilizing the public ledger for increased audits. Permissioned blockchains, Permissioned govern, blockchains information govern information exchange among a group of authorized participants. Frameworks like Hyperledger Fabric link to Hedera to benefit from decentralized trust without revealing its contents. HBR is available on Coinbase and was trading for 5 cents at the start of October 2022. Gas prices are predictable. Hedera's smart contract 2.0 offering is one of the key reasons investors utilize it. One of the few upgrades is the improved version, which connects Hedera smart contract service with Hedera token service, HTS. The price of Hedera has risen 3.77% in the last 24 hours to 6 cents. HBAR has increased by more than 6% in the last week, rising from 6 cents to its current price. The current all-time high for the coin is 57 cents. The chart below compares Hedera's price movement and volatility over the last 24 hours to its price movement over the last week. The gray bands are Bollinger Bands, which measure volatility in daily and weekly price fluctuations. The greater the volatility, the broader the bands are or the bigger the gray region is at any particular time. The coin's trading volume has increased 148% in the last week, while its overall circulating supply has increased 0.32% to over 24.35 billion, accounting for an estimated 48.69% of its maximum supply of 50.00 billion. HBARD now ranks 39th in terms of market capitalization, with $1.52 billion. A few days ago this was posted by Coinbase Assets on Twitter. HBAR deposit address generation has been disabled temporarily while we investigate an issue with our implementation of memo tags. Withdrawals are still available. We will provide updates on here and status.exchange.coinbase.com. By working with corporate network Hetera, UK investment company Abern is taking another significant step into the digital asset area. The asset management, which manages $579 billion in assets, will join the Hedera Governing Council with Google, FIS, Standard Bank, and Nomura. We're really long-term investors, said Duncan Moyer, senior investment manager at Auburn. We see this as being a very long-term story for us and for the industry. Auburn, originally Standard Life Aberdeen, is a behemoth in the UK investment business. It was created in 1825 and provides a variety of investment services with an emphasis on investment solutions, tools, and technology for financial advisors, as well as a personal wealth company. The business believes that utilizing Hedera to tokenize investment funds, which can subsequently be listed on digital marketplaces, has promise. According to Moyer, tokenization would allow a secondary market for funds with fewer frequent redemptions and generate prospects for greater price discovery. Moyer emphasized that it is also a step toward a totally on-chain procedure. Abrin isn't the only company experimenting with investment fund tokenization. Hamilton Lane, an investment manager with $832.5 billion in assets under management, tokenized three funds this week in collaboration with Securitize. KKR has also been looking towards tokenizing money on the Avalanche blockchain. For a few years, 
The business dabbled in the digital assets market, initially investigating crypto as an asset class inside hedge funds. It then jumped into the deep end early this year with a major position in digital asset exchange ARCACs, paving the way for investors to explore possibilities in digital securities while also connecting current offers via tokenization. Moyer anticipates that Abrin will reveal more about the company's objectives in the digital assets market before the end of the year. On to XRP. XRP may have bottomed. A few articles claim XRP price bottom may have came and passed. Cryptocurrencies fell today on dismal U.S. inflation numbers, which are incorrectly related to crypto market quotes. Despite macroeconomic gloom, XRP outperformed the top 10 cryptocurrencies by market capitalization, according to CoinMarketCap. XRP's performance and chart imply the bottom may have passed. XRP's price fell during the last several days, although just 4% on average, while other cryptocurrencies dropped double digits. XRP has challenged the critical support level of 47 cents three times since September and each time's dropping below that price level was a false break, which is a significant indicator in the present market. XRP abandoned the $0.30 cents to $0.40 cents area it had been trading in since early May as the Ripple lawsuit against the SEC became clear. XRP's chart suggests the accumulation stage is done and the price corridor is the bottom. There is still pressure on XRP quotations owing to continuing lawsuit and a very poor economic situation but the closer the resolution, the fewer the links to XRP's price. Prediction for XRP In a recent tweet, Wheat Say Wind, XRP Ledger's principal developer, revealed the implementation of an on-ramp solution to the SUM wallet. Users will be able to buy XRP for fiat straight from their bank accounts using the new innovation. The new product is now only accessible in the Netherlands, where the SUM wallet creators are based. Wind, on the other hand, aims to expand to Belgium, Germany, and the United Kingdom. Later, an off-ramp option for selling XRP for fiat currencies will be provided to the wallet. With more news on Ripple The CEO of Ripple estimates when the SEC litigation will be resolved. Ripple CEO Brad Garlinghouse told an audience at the DC Fintech Week conference that he expects the SEC's action against his business to be settled in the first half of 2023. He intends to resolve the litigation within the next three or four months, but he is not ruling out the possibility that it may take longer. Garlinghouse also said that Ripple might consider settling with the SEC if XRP is recognized as a non-security. Now on to Shiba Inu as it goes parabolic in the trending news on social media platform type of sense. As part of Shiba Swap, the Shiba team will host a burn gateway. According to the Shiba Inu team's release, the Shiba Swap decentralized exchange will continue to host the official Shiba Burn webpage. Shiba Inu's own development team will power the site. In addition, the developers are working on an extra burn utility method. The Shiba Inu team will give more information to its users regarding the mechanics of the reward system. The Ryoshi Vision-powered Shiba Burn site, which launched in April, enabled users to remove tokens from circulation while simultaneously generating passive income in the form of Ryoshi Vision, Ryoshi, ERC-20 tokens. That will conclude today's update on trending news in the crypto world. Remember, the social media platforms will be up and running next week. With the last channel being deleted we must now start over. Don't forget we have a $50 giveaway for when we hit 200 subs and followers on all social platforms. We also raised the giveaway for 1000 subs on YouTube to a $200 giveaway. Don't miss out all you have to do is like, follow, subscribe and tag as many people as you can. We will be watching who tags who and keeping tabs on which one of those tags actually followed and subscribed. I repeat, this is not a random drawing. Anyone can compute the giveaways themselves. Good day, good night, and goodbye.